What the heck is going on at the box office this weekend? Barbie continues to explode and absolutely exceed all expectations. And expectations were high. And Barbenheimer is still dominating the box office. Barbie is about to be the biggest Warner Bros. movie of all time. Put that in your mind. The biggest Warner Bros. movie of all time, period. That is insane. And the biggest movie of the year almost being Mario. Almost. Oppenheimer continues to explode as well. I mean, pun intended. It wasn't really intended, but now it's intended because I made the pun. And I like that pun, so. Anyways, Oppenheimer is continuing to explode. And it might, through projections, might even get to $900 million. Insane. And has a chance at being the second highest grossing rated R movie of all time. Behind Joker, of course, which is not getting beaten. That made like over a billion dollars. This film is currently the biggest rated R biopic of all time. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem has not opened worldwide yet. So with that in mind, domestically, it's doing pretty well. But I just hope it opens worldwide soon and that people get go to see it in theaters. Because I'm not sure if they will. Because the digital release date is September 5th. The Last Voyage of the Demeter is the brand new movie that hit theaters this weekend. I did not see it. I didn't see it because I had legitimately not a lot of interest in it. I might check it out if there isn't a lot of you know, movies coming out in August. But right now, it bombed real hard. It opened less than $10 million domestically. Yikes. Meg 2 is fizzling out at the box office, which it had a huge start and then had a minus 58% this weekend. That is just sad, but it's not a great movie, according to people that I've seen it. I haven't seen it because, again, I had just no interest in it. Um, Gran Turismo opened worldwide, and France, in France specifically, it's doing really well there. Overall, it's doing fine, but it hasn't opened dis domestically yet. I've actually seen it at an early screening. I thought it was a fun time. My full review is on YouTube, like my, on my main channel. But right now... That's what the box office is looking like. Barbenheimer is dominating still.